Welcome to our channel, your go-to destination for comprehensive and informative guides on all things health. Today we're diving deep into a medication that's been making waves in the medical world. But before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that like button. Your support means everything to us. So let's get started. What is warfarin? Warfarin sold under the brand name Coumadin is a medication used to prevent and treat blood clots in your legs, lungs, heart, and brain. It works by slowing down the production of certain proteins that are responsible for blood clotting. This makes it easier for the blood to flow smoothly through your veins and arteries, which can help to prevent blood clots from forming or reduce their size. If they have already formed, warfarin targets specific proteins in your blood called vitamin K-dependent clotting factors. These proteins play a crucial role in the blood clotting process through when your body senses an injury to a blood vessel, it starts producing these proteins to form a clot and stop the bleeding. However, when warfarin is present, these proteins are less effective at doing their job, resulting in thinner blood and a reduced risk of blood clots. It's important to note that warfarin doesn't directly dissolve existing clots, but it does reduce the risk of new ones forming. Is warfarin right for you? While warfarin is an effective medication for preventing and treating blood clots, it's not right for everyone. Sure, doctor. We'll consider various factors such as your medical history, current medications and lifestyle before prescribing warfarin. One of the main concerns with warfarin is its potential for serious side effects, particularly bleeding. Warfarin can cause excessive bleeding, which can be dangerous, especially if it occurs in the brain or other vital organs. Therefore, your doctor will assess your risk of bleeding and other factors such as kidney or liver function to determine whether warfarin is safe for you. Tens. Additionally, warfarin can interact with a wide range of medications, including antibiotics, pain relievers, and herbal supplements. Your doctor will review your medications to minimize the risk of harmful interactions. If you have any concerns or questions about whether warfarin is right for you, don't hesitate to discuss them with your healthcare provider. They can help you weigh the risks and benefits and make an informed decision. Avoid these mistakes. Now that you know how warfarin works and who it's right for, it's time to learn about some common mistakes to avoid while taking this medication. One of the most common mistakes is not telling your doctor about all the medications you're taking. As we mentioned earlier, Warfarin can interact with a wide range of medications, and these interactions can increase the risk of side effects. Be sure to tell your doctor about all your prescription and over-the-counter medications, including aspirin and other non-prescription drugs. Another mistake to avoid is not getting regular blood tests. Your doctor will need to monitor your blood while you're retaking warfarin to ensure that it's working properly and to adjust your dosage if needed. Don't skip those appointments. Finally, don't take more or less warfarin than your doctor recommends. It's important to follow your doctor's instructions carefully to ensure that warfarin is working properly and to minimize the risk of side effects. Remember, knowledge is power. By avoiding these common mistakes, you can help ensure that warfarin is a safe and effective treatment option for you. Before we continue, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel and hit that like button. Your support helps us reach more people with valuable health information. Now, let's get back to the video. Warfarin 101 If you've been prescribed warfarin, you may be wondering what you need to know before starting this medication. Let's break down some essential information on warfarin 101 to help you understand how it works, its potential side effects and how to take it properly. Warfarin is a vitamin K antagonist which means it interferes with the body's ability to produce certain proteins involved in the blood clotting process. By reducing the amount of these proteins, warfarin prevents the formation of blood clots and reduces the risk of stroke, heart attack, and pulmonary embolism. When taking warfarin, your blood becomes thinner, which reduces the risk of blood clots. It's essential to be aware of the signs of bleeding while taking warfarin, such as unusual bruising, heavy menstrual bleeding, or blood in the urine or stools. It's also important to note that warfarin can interact with other medications, including aspirin and ibuprofen. These interactions can increase the risk of bleeding. Therefore, it's crucial to inform your healthcare provider about all the medications you're retaking to avoid harmful interactions. Now, let's talk about how to take warfarin. 
The dose of warfarin that you need depends on several factors, including your age, weight, and the condition being treated. It's essential to take warfarin regularly and at the same time each day to maintain a consistent level of the medication in your bloodstream. Your healthcare provider will determine your dosage and may adjust it based on regular blood tests. They LL use a blood test called an INR to measure how long it takes for your blood to clot. The goal is to keep your INR within a specific range that your doctor recommends. The hidden dangers of warfarin. While warfarin is a highly effective medication for preventing blood clots, there are hidden dangers that patients should be aware of. Excessive bleeding is one of the most significant risks associated with warfarin therapy. If you notice any signs of bleeding, contact your healthcare provider immediately. Another hidden danger of warfarin is its potential to cause birth defects. If you're pregnant or planning to become pregnant, it's essential to avoid taking warfarin as it can cause serious birth defects in the developing baby. Instead, Talk to your healthcare provider about alternative medications that are safe during pregnancy. Warfarin can also interact with various foods and medications, leading to reduced effectiveness or increased side effects. For example, consuming large amounts of vitamin C or K can interfere with warfarin's effectiveness. Therefore, it's essential to consult with your healthcare provider about your diet and any supplements. You're retaking to ensure that they woe on to interfere with your warfarin therapy. By being aware of these hidden dangers and taking the necessary precautions, you can help ensure that you have a safe and effective treatment experience with warfarin. Mastering warfarin. When it comes to managing blood clots, warfarin is a powerful medication that can save lives, too. However, like any powerful tool, it requires skill and precision to use effectively. Mastering warfarin involves understanding its mechanism of action, potential side effects, and how to monitor its effectiveness. One of the most common side effects is bleeding, which can occur when warfarin thins the blood too much and makes it difficult for the body to stop bleeding. Therefore, it's essential to monitor for signs of bleeding, such as excessive bruising or bloody stools, and contact your healthcare provider immediately if you notice any signs. Another important aspect of mastering warfarin is regular monitoring of its effectiveness through something called the International Normalized Ratio, or INR. The INR is a measurement of how long it takes for your blood to clot, and your healthcare provider will use this information to determine the appropriate dose of warfarin for you. By understanding the importance of regular monitoring and being proactive in managing your treatment, you can help ensure that warfarin is a safe and effective treatment option for you. Others may encounter interactions with other medications or food, leading to reduced effectiveness or increased side effects. Despite these challenges, Warfarin remains an essential tool in the fight against blood clots. By working closely with your healthcare provider and following your treatment plan carefully, you can help ensure that warfarin is a safe and effective treatment option for you. Remember, knowledge is power. By understanding the potential side effects and risks of warfarin, you can take the necessary precautions to stay safe and healthy. Another essential guideline is to monitor your symptoms closely and report any unusual bleeding or changes in your health to your doctor immediately. This includes excessive bruising, heavy menstrual bleeding, blood in the urine or stools, or any other concerning symptoms. By following these essential guidelines, you can help ensure that you stay safe and healthy while taking warfarin. Remember, knowledge is power. Thank you for watching and subscribing. See you in the next video.